bad boy sent me to the doctor. to my home welcome 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 and if you're returning hey y'all hey so guys um i've been out to target early this morning to do a pickup um the other item i don't know why i took it in my office but um guys if you have not gotten your hands on these mm, they smell so good it is the method hand wash in the savage and Maine and it smell so good so good so um i did pick up two of these and right now are in target um rather you go in the store or online you got to be a target a spot target pot spot whatever it's called you just got to have the the target on there you can get 15 percent off of those i want to share with y'all the other thing that i got i got the hair up and go but let me run upstairs to go get the other item okay um i was looking at they put your pickup on your bag the other item i picked up guys um i forgot what the other name of the body wash feminine wash Got what the name of it, but that bad boy sent me to the doctor. If I remember, I put it right here. What it is, anybody use that? Good look. So, um, this is a new one. I have extremely sensitive skin, so I did pick up this. This is new, so this is the foam wash, no fragrance, sulfurate, and probate. Oh, peritons free with vitamin E. You can tell, the girl been running on the staircase. Um, this was also 15% off. Trying to get something to open it, because I have not even opened it. Um, these were $6.99. So, with the 15, you would get 15% off. So you get like about $2.30 off. Um, this is what the container looks like. So, um, I got that. My hands are so ashy, but I just came downstairs and the lotion I want to put on is in the car. So, um, this guys was, uh, oh, they put somebody else receipt in my bag. Um, but if I'm not mistaken, um, this was like $12, I think. I think it was like $12. So, um, yeah, that's what I pick up from Target. I had those on order. And in the store, they say they did not have these. I did on order. Thing was ready. I, the thing ding me, order pick up. I'm like... So, next, guys... I have, I did go on my community tab to update y'all, um, to tell you what's going on with my dad. Um, he had emergency surgery last week, he had emergency surgery again last night. Um, the daughters didn't even bother by calling him, nor my sister and I. I'm like, where did they do that at? Last week, I mean, he had emergency surgery in less than a week, two in a week, I'll say it that way. Um, they didn't call us with the first one. Only thing we knew is about 11, 30, 12 noon that we get a phone call that daddy had emergency surgery. I'm like, you don't do that. So last night, once again, we didn't get a call. Happened, daddy called and said, hey, they get ready to take me back in emergency surgery. No doctor, no nurse called my sister nor I to say, hey, surgery went well, whatever, nothing. So, um, update. 
They found some more issues, so they will be airlifting my dad to Atlanta. Yeah, so he will be in the hospital in Atlanta. So um, I went and picked him up some new PJs, and these are the um, Polo Ralph Lauren. You know I'm that Ralph Lauren girl. And Daddy loves blue, he loves black, he loves navy, and he loves gray. So these, I think they are so cute. In the hospital, it can get cool, so, um, and I did like that. They better be glass for him, because I love that. It, night pants, summertime, no. I put these on with a cute little um, t-shirt and a cute little pair of sandals. So, um, I pack him a bag. Wait a minute, hold up. You know you lying. <laughs> Child, my boy got his socks still in this bag. Um, I might have to go by and pick up Daddy another bag. Or should I? Um, I think I'm going to stop by again because this is my son's bag. Um, I think I'm just run by and get him another bag. So I just put his clothes on the seat. I have run by Target or somewhere um, on the way going. I am waiting for an Amazon package, not Amazon, H&M package. And I don't know, it was better for me to walk to the door to see if it was delivered. I know it's probably not here. And it's not, and I know we have a lot boxes here at our, um, it's just like the post office. We have a key just to open our small box, but if we have a bigger package, um, they will leave the key inside our box and we just go to the bottom of our mailbox and get it. Or if it's too big, they will put it on our door. Well, this is coming from DHL. Um, I just ordered so much from H&M. I didn't find out. They, they um, send itself DHL. Um, I'm trying to think there is anything else I need to take with me going to my dad. Because I need to... Oh, I took chicken out because I want me some air fried chicken wings. So I will do that when I get back. But I, I took the chicken out last night because that bad boy was solid hard rock. So guys, and I did my hair. Of course, you can see. Put on your glasses so you can see. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I, I, I'm, I'm in that mood, but I'm not in that mood. But what God is, is what God has for you. So let's go head on. Got my peace drink. Um, Let's go head on. I need to go stop by and get daddy another carry bag. I'm not going to take my son on. I'm going to have to take that back upstairs when I come back because I know he'd be like, why is my bag down here? Because of your mama moving. So I got to go stop by and get my dad on. I think I'm going to take the back way instead of the front way. Anyway, let's go. Okay, guys, so. I'm about to say, uh, push start. What's going on? Because I'm, father's right here. I'm like, going on you see me i had to look twice um i keep my pocketbook forever in the car so my son been out i think my son been out that's why i'm looking because 
I thought his car was on that side this morning. It was. He's he's been out. So y'all, it's about time to me to replenish that. Child, let me just cut that radio down. So y'all don't ask me how I do this. And I have my other Fenty in the house, and that one is almost brand new. And I use this one. Why? Because I can. Look at that. That is glowing the D. Might pick up me a honey dip. Let me stop. I ain't looking for nobody. And mine is out of town. Let me cut. Okay. Let, let me put this out there. Y'all, it's some people. I can't say anything. You know, TikTok. I mean... You just do stuff on TikTok for some of for fun. So I did the one said um um something about you married. I should have should have never left. I should have been a runaway bride or whatever. Um I did that one. Lo and behold, here I am. I'm getting messages. Um you and your husband ain't together no more. No. No, we're not. He's at work in another state. I'm in the other state, but he come home, nosy. So now, um, I want me a pair of Diera um, Love Scent um shades, y'all. Let me tell you, it opened up to get the shades at twelve o'clock. <laughs> Eleven fifty nine. I'm like, click. Sold out. I'm like, what? Dear, <laughs> girl, I didn't get your shades. So I got to keep wearing these until you restock and I can put my hands on them. But um, I wanted the lime green ones and I wanted the black ones because it took me a while to sell okay, camera. Because you know, back in the day, they used to call these Ray Charles glasses. Or the glass that you get from when you go get your eyes exam. <laughs> I love them. I can't remember where I got them from. But I know I paid like $26 for them. I don't know. All right. Um, let me go ahead and set my music. Because, you know, it, it, we got to be up on that type of beat. So I always um, play my, mm -hmm. I'll see if it's still, it's on YouTube. <laughs> Hey guys, I come by and check on Cherry every day. And I got a good glimpse of my baby. Oh, she is so messed up. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, the back end off of her, everything is just towed up. see my baby like that so i would insert a picture guys of my car i kind of like took a picture from the gate so therefore the bumper is not in the other items that are on back order evidently they're not in also so but the day is wednesday yeah today is wednesday so it was still waiting for some parts I've never seen my baby like that. I know y'all like, girl, that's so materialistic. That's a car. I've had cars, total loss, I don't, whatever. But um, when your car is getting worked on, it's just like another feeling seeing your automobile broke down like that. It's just a whole nother type of feeling. And to know that she was slammed like that so disrespectful 
That was so disrespectful. So, um, they got her up there close because we were looking at the wrong automobile the whole time. We were looking, it's another automobile just like mine, same color that is there also. So Amber and I was looking at the wrong automobile the whole entire time. So I want to come by. I was just like, maybe I'll take a chance. Oh no. I'll take a chance by um coming by Goodwill first and see if I can just buy a, a bag because I keep sanitary wipes and stuff in here. So um if I find one in here, that'd be cheaper than paying $25, $30 for And you know, the people, other people are not going to take care of yourself. Not my dad. I'm talking about the people at the hospital and transporting him and all that. So, um, and it's some of this goodwill wanting to see something. They want to see Amber's prom dress. So, um, that video, hopefully that video will come to y'all next week. Breaking down with her getting ready, her dress, her getting ready and prom, some of the stuff that she did at the prom. So that video is coming. So nevertheless, let me go. Okay, guys, I am back. Um, It's crazy, y'all. Every Goodwill, I know it's different, but if they got a scale, they need to have all the store, same stores on the same scales. So of course, I am out here to the Goodwill in my town and it's expensive. It is very, very expensive over here. Um, they will have a Dollar Tree glass. Someone got glasses from Dollar Tree and you can find them in there. And lo and behold, you better believe they have hush they have probably about five dollars on the glass yeah um i was looking at the totes because i know at the other one tote bags are four dollars and four cents well over here they're thirteen dollars and 99 cents okay so i turned around and got my daddy a whole piece of luggage for eight dollars okay mm -mm, no and I know daddy don't have a piece of luggage and he hasn't called me so because I don't want to miss seeing him because no he hasn't called me no y'all my car I had to send a picture to my baby Yo, I'm going to say it's kind of hot Too much sun. I know it's a sun roof, but I don't want. It's a good way to me to get some vitamin D to tan my melanin. <clears throat> Cause you know we black, we run from the sun. Well, I don't. I I actually love the sun. Downfall is because of so much of my medicine. It's not good to be in the sun. You know what? I did not zip that bag to make sure the zipper worked. I'd be pissed. Zipper work. Yes, it works. So I just thought about that. That would have been so dumb. It's so dumb, but um, the manager on duty. That's my that's my boy. That's my boy. I always get hooked up with somebody in Goodwill, and we end up just good friends. And I walk in, he was like, "Hey, friend." So I told him, I said, "You know, I was doing my baby prom dress." He was like, "Girl, girl, shut up." I was like, yeah, so it's a piece that he want me to make for him. So um, I'm just waiting for him to give me the photo of it so I can do the measurements and stuff. Why are they on? This car, oh, 
people just make you sick when they're not paying attention. I need to stop and give me something to eat. I don't know what I want to eat. I hope this wind is not bugging. Y'all see it when you're there. So, um, I don't want to head to Atlanta. Well, I'm not sure if they're going to move daddy today. We just getting everything prepped and y'all are so crooked. Be like the old people say, you crookedly. You crookedly, darling. Darling, move your head because you're crookedly. So, um, I'm not sure. I don't want to go and run to Atlanta and they, he's not there. So, well, that doesn't make sense. I don't want to go on to Atlanta when they send him because I don't know right off when they're going to call me and tell me my car is ready, which I know it won't be today nor tomorrow for the simple reason um, I see what my car look like. And also they still got to check whatever the front end of my car doing. You hit those brakes and my whole front end takes off. I'm like, what the hamburger? Girl, just tow up my car. So, um, I need to say I bet them payments gonna be paid. <laughs> and the words of payment, and what about it? And that's seven hundred dollars. And y'all, I don't understand. I was not a contributor. To, I need to call my insurance company because they might be losing me as a customer. This accident was not my fault at all. But my renewal was to is is coming up on the first or something like that. My renewal. So you tell me why my insurance went up. Why is my insurance $180? I was not a contributor to that accident. So I need to call, I'm gonna call them to Zai and be like, baby, you need to tell me what in the ham bone turkey wing is going on because I was not a contributor to that accident. I was sit parked at the red light and got slammed from the back. So why is my insurance going up? You gonna tell me. So you know what? I gotta pass by Bojangles. And I'ma eat chicken for dinner. Yeah, I ain't gonna eat chicken now. But I Man shucks. That's hot. I'll see how they can well I had a car that was totally um a Mustang and I don't know how I roll with all of that off. Child. That's hard. I, I do it this way. Go ahead and turn the air conditioner on because you it is 73. Yesterday our high guys was 92 91 and I kid you not, it was 91. All of a sudden, we had this storm that lasts about 10 minutes. And the temperature dropped to 61. 61 degrees. So it dropped 30 degrees lower because that warm rain came out. So I didn't know what was going on because I was like, what in the heck is getting in Georgia? The wind was up high. I mean, stuff was flying everywhere. I was like, if it's a tornado, baby, let me know. Because, baby, mm -mm, girlfriend can't, mm -mm, no, baby. So um, today is a pretty day. Pretty hot, too. So for y'all states that having snow, Y'all want us to send y'all some heat in a job? We send it for free here in Georgia. Because the heat in South Carolina, we discovered is a whole different type of heat here in Georgia. Oh my God. Guys, and I'm pretty sure that, and I know, because when we went to Florida, that heat was different. Oh my gosh. 
I, everybody in Florida, I love y'all. Mm -mm. It's not for you, girl. Mm -mm. I like wearing weave in the summertime. I don't know how y'all do it down there. I, I really don't. Wigs and weaves, I don't know how you do it because, girl, that hot date. Oh, I don't know where this man here, well, what funeral he's attending, but baby, I ain't got time. He's in a whole funeral possession. And I don't even see the hearse. It's a man driving so dang slow. And now he want to turn off back there. Mm -mm. I'm gone. I need to go get some Bojangles. Oh, shit. Shoot. Dang light caught me. So. Guys, that's it. Y'all, when I get a bunch of KFC. I get what you're the KFC. Um, yes. I want to get... I want to get the number two combo. The original? Yes. You want mashed potatoes and gravy? Um, could I get fries? And my drink is your new Mountain Dew with no ice. Okay, have it in for a two piece white fries, not loose sweet like it, I guess. That's all. Seven fifty five. Y'all, that new mountain do be busting. Key thing. Never ever, ever get a drink with ice. The machine keeps the drink cold. And I know I got this. And I know that. But never ever get ice in your drink. Because um, when you get ice in your cup, if you get a large, a, a, well, I would say a medium. You get a medium, they fill your cup all the way up with ice. That means you're getting about that much a drink, which you're not getting your money's worth. instead of and I know most likely daddy cannot eat anything I think he's back on a clear diet so. thank you I put no hot sauce in my bag. I don't know. Way my husband, I asked him to go get me something to eat one night. And I never got what it was. And I said, babe, I said, I need some hot sauce. My husband stopped turning around and looking at me. He said, you need what? <laughs> I said, I don't know. I just got a taste of some hot sauce. And he was like, you don't need hot sauce. I said, no, I ain't pregnant either. So, I, that night I just wanted hot sauce. Well, I don't forgot. Why would you slow up? Get your hamburger helper behind out my way. So, and guess what? I think it's a sandwich, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, in my bag. See, I could have went ready to that big jingles. I just, it's just, it's something about KFC. Shoot, I didn't get barbecue sauce. So anyway, y'all, I said, y'all, you dumb behind. Go fly it in front of me. Anywho, okay, guys, I have made it to the hospital. So, I had to sit here and sanitize this 
um, little suitcase. So I was sitting here trying to get it all sanitized. So he has his own little luggage. It's luggage. <clears throat> So, oh shoot, this is the like the little carry-on luggage piece. Um, keys, mask, cause gotta wear a mask in the hospital anyway. <sighs> Come in those little silk. I'm out and do busting. Leave that up. Maybe shoot. Just put it over so I can get some ventilation. <clears throat> it won't be as hot when I get big. get out of school so I should be good but so depend on how long he come from this test because it takes me about 30 minutes to get back to my town from where I am currently so 30 yeah about 30 minutes so, I'm going to wait for that. Okay, guys. I am getting ready to leave the hospital. <sighs> so, I had to put on my nurse hat, y'all. Because they didn't know how to set up my daddy bed. So, I had to put on my nurse hat. I know that mess a mess up my lipstick. Hey y'all, I'm 
I'm gonna take the back way home. You gonna wait for me, honey? Honey. So, they're not going to move my dad today, so it's a possibility it'd be tomorrow, so, um, so he'll be going to the hospital in Atlanta, I think I said that, <sighs> so... get up in a whole bunch of traffic because I'm taking a back way home. Huh? Oh, that's right. I can, it's another way I can take to go on. Um, there's two different back ways that I can go to go home. So I'm going to take this way and then take the other back one this way. I can come into the back of my subdivision and y'all are crooked. So of course, um, that is in very good spirits and they're laughing and tripping out. So it's a whole bunch of stuff we had to kind of like talk and get taken care of. So um, I got to go down to his house um, one day next week so I can get all of his bills paid, go in and check the house. Um, why is this man looking at me? Oh my gosh. Gee whiz. Can I tell you, I don't know what's going on for the last few days. Even yesterday, I had a man to actually give me his telephone number told me to give him a call. I'm like, sir, uh, sir, like, uh, sir, I'm married. I'm sitting there like, I'm, I'm married. <laughs> Last time I check, I am. But anyway, I, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the summertime, but I ain't even got no sundress. I got some. Anyway, let me stop. Good for sitting in the shade. That's my drink. It's still cool. So, of course, when I got there, Daddy was in a test. Um, I didn't put the camera in his face, whatever. He's in good spirits. I know he would have said something to y'all. But um, I was trying to get a lot of stuff done and a lot of stuff talked so I can make sure everything he needed to get done. Oh, shoot. I have a call to find out about how much one of his bills. Yeah, I have a call to find out how much one of his bills and let him know he's in the hospital so I know what I'd be paying for that bill. And of course, I got his card. I will put all his receipts and stuff with it. So, I do that all on one day because, let me tell you, that's a four-hour drive round trip. Unless my sister meet me and I just give her the, um, the cashier's check because I'm going to go and get two cashier's check so I can have that stuff paid. And I told him he don't need to worry. He was over there talking about his groceries. I was like, Daddy, you're not going to be home. We don't know exactly when you're going to be home. So we don't need to worry about that right now. I don't need to be worried about that. We just need to get you better. That's all we need. So I asked the nurses, well, Daddy feet and legs are just like huge. They're so swollen to even his toes look like a pig nose they they are so swollen so i said daddy you need to keep your legs up in the bed and your head up just a little bit but your feet is up as high as it possibly can get 
So the foot of the bed wouldn't go up with a certain amount. So I asked the nurse, I said, well, um, is it possible that you can find me two pillows? Because I need two pillows and a blanket so I can tuck the pillows to keep his feet up to get some of that fluid down. She was just like, well, you know, we have a shortage on pillows. Now, I done heard a shortage for gas, shortage of bread, shortage of eggs. And now you gonna tell me they got a shortage of pillows. Yo, where they do that? <laughs> I'm sitting there like, a shortage of what, ma'am? A shortage of freaking pillows. I heard it all. So, I was waiting for her to bring the covers. My dad had three stacks of sheets, dirty sheets, pile up different places. When I said, yes, I'm an RN, those sheets disappeared. I said, um, I need two pillows and a sheet so I can put the pillows on the bottom and um, tuck them so him getting out in and out of bed that won't move that's what she told me there's a shortage of pillows in the hospital so she came back and got the pillows now his sheets every day on his bed muscle was dirty already because it was one that was folded up that i was going to use that was sitting at the front of his bed at the foot of the bed but um, she just went ahead on and just took all of it and just hoop it right in the dirty clothes. So it left him with no blanket. Very sweet. But I'm like, understand this fundamental. I, I mean, maybe it's just me. So um, she came back and brought two pillows and a sheet. She put the pillowcases on the pillows. You know, she literally stood there. I said, I put the pillows in and put everything like I wanted. Now, common sense to tell you if a patient is in the hospital and they have to put their feet up and they're the only person in the bed, sheet tucking. You need two pillows, one sheet, fold it. Sheet tucking. <coughs> Homegirl ain't even know what that was. She literally stood there and looked at me. I didn't know that's how you do that. Girl, bye. So I took the, yeah, oh Lord, that plane low. I literally look at that man face. Wow. So, um, they got to do some massive stuff to take that sheet off that bed because baby I got that thing tucked so far up under that mattress so him getting in and out of the bed he can kick it or whatever that is not moving <sighs> so that is done so I had my son to pick up my baby from school because she's been out of school now oh god about 30 minutes yeah it's been 30 minutes since she's been out of school so I'm headed home Something keep mouthing me in my eye. I'm headed home. I need to cook. And then I need to sit down and edit. Because your girl has three videos. This one is the fourth one. And I got the... I don't upload the other ones. I just got to edit. And guys, be aware. Right now, I got a lot going on. So, my regular editing skills, you may not see that. Um, I know you're going to get, you probably get this video on, today is Wednesday, so you probably get this on Monday coming, today is Wednesday, so you won't get it until, um, I got too much other footage I need to go ahead and get out. Um, for Saturday, y'all have a Ashley Furniture, um, I'm looking for new living room furniture and of course I wanted Ashley and if not Ashley um, maybe Bra Hill but I've been hearing stuff negative about Bra Hill lately 
so I don't know. I don't have to worry about the performance um, furniture, linen, I mean, material. I don't have no little kids. So, therefore, and nobody goes in my living room drinking and all kind of stuff. My chair in my living room is four years old in excellent condition. Um, I can easily sell my chairs for $500 easily because they've only been sat on maybe five times. Maybe five. So, um, yeah. But I did see two sets that I like, which I don't have to consult with my husband about any of that because I pay for everything in the house. All the way down to the last washcloth, to the paper towels, to the toilet tissue. I pay for all of that. He only pays for the mortgage, okay? So whatever I do in the house, I don't never ask him because he don't care anyway. So um, I want to, I'm thinking about changing the furniture. So, um, but I know I want a neutral color. So that upload may be neutral furniture at Ashley Furniture. I think that's what the title that y'all will see for that. Cause, um, but y'all probably get some, y'all did get some color pieces in there and also some de decorative pieces. <laughs> he's on a slingshot. I had a look because, why is this man walking in the road? Um, he's on a slingshot. I heard all the noise. I had a look. Honey, round here, you see so many African-American guys on slingshots. They are in the, now my son want one. I'm sitting there like, boy, mm, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I really don't know about that. So, guys, um, I might give y'all a quick cook with me because I am going to do some chicken. I don't know if I want to air fry it, which that would make it easier, some air fried jerk chicken wings or I know I took chicken wings out exactly how I'm going to make them I'm not quite sure yet y'all see the slingshot see right there and he got that bad boy jamming it's red and black he got red and black rims on that bad boy he got it bumping too but anywho, I see y'all when I get home. Well, hi, people. I am officially home. Pantry door open. Mm -hmm. I need to organize it again. Anywho, um, I came in. Guys, I came ready and washed my hands, standing here talking. So, baby girl, and guess what? Girl, I already done put her chicken wings on. So, I'm going to just go ahead and show y'all because it's no biggie. I showed y'all exactly what I put in it. But, um... It's the lining of the chicken wings for me. So let me go ahead and show y'all the seasoning. Then I'm going to show you the Guys, chicken. This is all the seasonings that I use. So if you want to do this, all of these go in the pan in the first beginning of you cooking what I am doing. So once again, here you go. Creole seasoning. Kind of butcher's all-purpose. Grill Master Sweet and Smoky. Heinz 57 sauce. Mm-hmm. And you see all the rings. And yeah, raw honey. Don't get that other stuff. Make sure you say raw. So those are the seasons. Chicken in the pan for me. Look at that. Look like a whole rump roast. Look like a wreck of lamb up in there. So that is how I never put my mm, hot. Never put my chicken in there, but isn't that pretty? But all those seasonings that I just showed you, all of that is on this. So I'm going to put the lid on it and let it cook for, yes, guys, I'm finna say 45 minutes. If you need to add more water, please do. But after this has cooked down for 45 minutes, then we are going to take these out and slam them in the air fryer. So see you back 45 minutes. Mm -hmm. 